ladies and gentlemen, please welcome onto the Clapham Grand Stage, Mr. Phil Jupiters. <laughs> What a fine, magical evening. All music, all mystery. We have concocted for nobody's dressed up. Nobody's dressed up. <laughs> no one else is. No one else is wearing the gear. They said they'd be wearing the gear. These. I went to a clinic in West London. These were on Betty Boothroyd 12 hours ago. <laughs> and not upstairs either. <laughs> so I phoned up the spiritual leader of Tibet. <laughs> And he sent me a large goat with a long neck. Turns out I'd phoned Dalai Lama. <laughs> Tell you what, as you're obviously so down in the dumps, why is that we do one of our little songs we do to cheer yourself up? <laughs> You're right! It is one of my good ideas. <laughs> After three, then. One. Anything you can do, I can do better. I can do everything better than you. <laughs> yes, I can. No, you can't. Yes, I can. No, you can't. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. <laughs> I'd never have suggested it if I'd known you were going to be so argumentative. <laughs> Now, I have to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, I did a very stupid thing on Saturday. I went to my local shopping centre on a Saturday, right? <laughs> stupid. I went, because, like, I don't know, the same way you are. You go on a Saturday, the whole place is just packed with teenagers <laughs> and their children. <laughs> <laughs> so, you would like a new suit? Yes, please. Mm. I'll measure you take off your clothes. OK. <laughs> Well, tell me, uh, how was Moscow? Oh, it was very cold. Mm -hmm. I don't like it when it is very cold. It mm. makes my penis shrink. And <laughs> mm. what do you know your shoe size? My shoe size, yes, it is one. <laughs> Although, I can slip into a lady's number two when push comes to shove. <laughs> You are very accommodating, very accommodating. <laughs> so, okay, I, I'm ready to measure you. You want to measure my inside leg? <laughs> this one or this one? <laughs> <laughs> 